These are drawings that I've done based on coffee stains. Um, so what I did with this piece of paper is, uh, well it's brown card and then I covered it in white paint. So what I did is I took a sponge roller and I covered it in white paint and then I rolled up the background, then I let it dry and then I took the bottom of a cup, dipped it into coffee, made these stains, let them dry and then used these pens. These pens are Faber Castells and they come in different shades so they're quite nice to create um, a drawing that's quite rich in value and it's quite easy to work with these pens. So that's the first drawing. That's another one been done with a smaller glass dipped into coffee and then used the pens um, to create the face. This was a drawing I did first and then what I did is I painted it into it with coffee so you can do that as well and it doesn't have to be done in pen. You can do it in pencil and then um, you can work the coffee over the, the pencil. The coffee shouldn't make the pencil run too much but if you're worried about it running then just seal it with a bit of artist fixative or what you can do is you can use um, hairspray and that will seal the drawing and then you can work the coffee into it. Okay, but rather try and work first because hairspray or fixative also does strange things to the surface of an artwork and it might um, affect the absorbency of the paper. So do a little test first before you um, just go ahead. This was done with a spill of coffee onto the surface and then what I did is I then did the drawing, I did the face. I can't remember why I did all the shattering of the face um, at the time but the point is that the original was a spill of coffee. This was also a spill of coffee so um, what I did is I did this, this spill and then I looked at the spill that I had done and I saw that it had these ears shaped and I thought that would actually be it. and it sort of suggested bunny to me and then I drew a little bunny over the surface. So for this lesson you'll need a bowl for mixing the coffee in, you'll need some instant coffee, I've boiled up some hot water here as well, I've got some white paper Okay, just normal, I'm going to move this away. I've got some cartridge paper. I have also a palette here and I'm not sure if I'm going to use that. And then I'm probably going to work with, with ink. So I'll use these drawing tools in um, the artwork. You'll need a range of brushes and you'll need some spoons for mixing the coffee and for adding water into your coffee mixture.